Hi YouTube. So this is a meet Doodles video. Doodles is a sweetheart. She's a little nervous. She's has a little bit of a nervous side to her, but she's very special because she love. I mean, I know all chickens love bugs. I know, but she really, 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 really. Because oh, let me tell you this. She is like the bravest chicken you will never meet. Aren't you, Doodles? You are a brave hen. She will go under heavy objects. When I lift logs, when I lift boulders, like huge rocks, not boulders, but you know, to her it would be a boulder. Wouldn't it, Doodles? <laughs> yes, it would. She'll go right under it. And it's crazy. I mean, chickens don't do that. No, I've never had a chicken that would do that. Most chickens are standoffish. They'll wait, you know, like if you're lifting up something heavy, they're not going to just go right under it, but she does. She'll go right under it. And she's a very, very brave hen, Doodles. You're a very brave hen. Because what if I one day, I don't know, like uh, Doodles, like it's dangerous, sweetheart. It's dangerous to go underneath heavy objects when I'm lifting them, but she will because she's, she wants those bugs like right away. Don't you doodles? You love bugs, huh, sweetheart? And she, she's really a miracle that she's even alive because when I got her, she was on death's door at the feed store, like totally like really on death's door. What do I mean? I mean, like, it was cold. Like, it was a cold, rainy, kind of like today, miserable. What was it? It was a March day. It was an early, cold, wintry March day. And the feed store did not have heat for them. And all the chickies that I saw, that I could tell, they all had the, um, the what they call pasty butt. But what happens is they're cold so the poop doesn't flow through it gets clogged up and it clogs it so that they can't go to the bathroom well when that happens they're pretty much going to be be dead especially if you don't get that off of there really quick can you imagine what that would be like to not be able to relieve yourself that would be a horrible horrible experience for these poor babies so i got them home got them warm but see this is a problem you don't want them to get too warm because if they do, then the poop wants to come out even more, and then they can't poop, and then it backs up and it kills them even faster. But you don't want them cold, because that can kill them too. So right when I got them home, I knew this. And I put them in my car with the little heater on a little bit. I didn't want them to be cold. And luckily, I didn't have far to drive. The feed store is not very far at all, huh, Doodles? It was very close. What well, didn't seem like a very long drive, did it, Doodles, when I brought you home? Didn't seem like a very long drive, did it, baby? No, I got you home quick. And right away, I cleaned their little butts off and got them under the heat lamp. And they got warm, and they were able to relieve themselves. Yes, you were. And when I got you home, that is, you were able to relieve yourself, huh, Doodles? And it's just a miracle that she's even alive, really. And really... She should have been an Easter egger, but she turned out to be a beautiful speckled <laughs> success. I really like the speckled success, so that was my second choice. So it's kind of odd that here I, I'm going to get Easter eggers, and I have get, end up getting a speckled sexist because she was in with the Easter eggers. <laughs> yes, you were, baby. You were in with the Easter eggers. I think what this feed store does is when they get low on chicks because they kill so many because they don't provide adequate heat, they just put them on in the same pen basically all the babies and they just call them all whatever they don't care you know but it's okay doodles because i love you and you're beautiful and actually speckled sexist was my second choice i really like you doodles you're a special baby you're a special chicky you're so special and you're so good yes you're so special baby i love you doodles i love doodles doodles and when i first got doodles like I said, I, I thought she was an Easter egger, and your name was going to be Faye, sweetheart. I call, I named her Faye. But then as she got bigger, because I still thought she was an Easter egger, I thought she was a rooster because she has a little comb. Don't you, sweetheart? 
And Easter eggers don't have cones, you know, only if they're roosters, though. So I thought, well, maybe it's a rooster, so I'll call them doodles, like cockadoodle doodles. Yes, baby. But the funny thing is, she's actually taken on the role of a rooster. How about you, sweetheart? And that's very common for hens. Well, not very common, but it is common for hens to take on a role of a rooster when there is no rooster. I don't have a rooster. I live in the city. I don't want neighbors complaining. I have like a unit in the back. I don't want renters to not want to rent because I have a rooster, so I don't choose to have roosters. Now, if I lived out in the country like I used to when I lived in Hawaii, I had roosters. That was fine. I had tons of chickens then, but my yard's so small. You know, I have five right now, and that's really kind of too many. Are you trying to crow, sweetheart? So she takes on the role, but she doesn't crow. But she acts like a rooster. So what do I mean? I mean, she'll let the other hens eat. She'll just kind of like peck at the food and like kind of encourage them a little. Um, she has tried to mount before. She don't get very far with it, but she does try. You try to mount. Yes, baby, you do. You try to mount the other hens. I've seen you. I've seen you do it, sweetheart. Halfway there. Yes, baby. You do it halfway. And just the way, kind of the way she acts is kind of roosterish. But you don't crow, sweetheart. But it's not impossible. Um, hens have been known to totally take on the role of a rooster and crow. So who knows, maybe she'll try to crow a little bit. No, you, maybe you will. Maybe you'll try to crow a little bit. But she's a real sweetheart. You being so good. You being so good. Doodles, you wanna say anything to you too? Sweetheart, you see, that's you. See, you wanna say anything to YouTube? No? Say something to YouTube. No, you want to go back outside? Look. You want to say something? Say bye-bye. You want to say bye-bye? You want to say bye-bye? You want to go back outside, don't you, sweetheart? You want to go back outside, I know, baby. I know you do. Well, that's doodles. That's doodles. the other hands are missing you doodles okay we'll say see you later say see you later see you later uh, all right take care bye